Hello, and welcome back. Uh, again, haven't played since the last one. One quest completed, two in the afternoon on the 24th. Still playing the game, absolutely loving it. That last run was amazing. Um, same quests available as last time. Like I said, I think I'm gonna do this one because it's shorter. I have a chance for a new weapon and a chance for a new amulet. We'll get a chance to see if we carry over our stuff from the last one. I do still have Hellish Ember, and I have Twilight, so rather than going in with Firestorm Grenade, which I just got, I mean, I absolutely love Firestorm Grenade in the first one, I think, uh, if it's the one that just does an explosive, but if it's because of the explosive grenade here, if it's the one that leaves fire on the ground, I hate that one, I run through it all the time, uh, I don't want Spirit Branch, I want the Soul Wand, I don't want the Falcon Wings, I want the Mana Stone, because especially if doing the missions is what gives you the upgrades of these, and then looks like my frost bow is not available so hellish ember since i already had a chance to upgrade this one i just need more coins i'm gonna keep going with hellish ember now let's see if we have disproportionate mana pools i kind of doubt we're going to carry over anything from the last castle because it gave me a chance to pick my equipment again but it may be that I carry those over until I die yeah see I don't have any of that stuff in here that I did on the last run so every time you do a mission it restarts you oh I also have this does that mean I could have equipped the staff also since I have a staff can I equip all of them that would be good I'll try that on the next mission like there's nothing down here except stuff to smash so i'm gonna stop smashing because uh i may come across a perk later where i regain stats or something from smashing Ugh. there's a little bit of lag uh, what is this room let's use the mana stone Before I go in there, I'm going to see what happens if I can use it again here. I can. So it looks like um, if I try to use that in combat, it'll say I can only use it once per room. But it looks like out of combat, I just have to wait for it to cool down and I can recover all of my mana types. Nice. Still no enemies. Uh... Okay, so it looks like this is the same as that last one where I had the green one. I sacrificed some alchemy mana because it's a yellow. Or no, this is health. Good. We'll start out the dungeon damage. Lower damage resistance. You earn more experience. Okay, so I take more damage, but I level up faster. I'll accept that. I'll just have to make sure that I get hit less. Or I get more barrier, get more... Uh, opportunity to recover shields. I'll definitely want to play with a more defensive set of skills this time. Defeat all the enemies! Also it would be nice if the abilities that do things told you what the percentage was. Okay, I don't know what that curse looking stuff is, but uh... Lost souls from doom. Ouch. Ooh, that one's like shielded or something. Ow. <laughs> I bombed myself. Okay. Not what I wanted. There we go. <laughs> there are little things that you can catch yourself on. They're kind of problematic. Yes, level two. Come at me, bro. All right, larger staff pool, earn a new staff if I already have one. So I think I'm gonna go with this one, wand, mana, and a larger pool for it because I don't already have a staff. So I'd rather find one. Uh. I'd rather find a staff and just have a larger pool for it 
then get a staff with no benefit because the second part of that other one only applies if I already have a staff. So, no good for me. Alright. Defeat all the enemies. Let's go with this one and see what we have. Alright, I knew there was going to be an upper floor to this with that thing. Hi! Oh jeez, he survived. Ouch. Woo -hoo -hoo. <laughs> There's another one. Where is he? Is he up above? Ouch. Okay, recover some mana at the start of the fight. A weapon chosen at random will get additional damage and fire rate. I only have three, and I like the ones that I have. So if I can shoot it faster and do more damage, plus get 20 barrier, hell yes. Um, I don't know if it switched to this one, meaning this one got the benefit. Is there a way to tell in here? Uh, damage 110%, damage 100%. 100%, so it's not showing it on that. This 10% is from leveling it up. Uh, Staff Hunter, Golden Weapon, still doesn't say which one, and who dares wins. Okay, so... It won't let me use my Mana Stone right now. Maybe because... No? Don't know why. Okay, nothing here, nothing here, nothing here. Drop down. Yeah, I'm still going to keep look- oh yes, nice. I'm still going to keep looking for uh, breakable walls and stuff like the first one, just in case they added that. It was such an important feature of the first game that I would have a hard time believing they just plain eliminated it with no plan of returning it. Okay, so this way... Things are a little framey at the moment. I don't believe it's the game. I think it's my computer trying to do something in the background. Okay. So far, these all appear to be souls, which means... Ah, there's something that's not a soul. Oh, he teleported. Whoops. Alright, so them to kill him, kill him, kill that dude. Alright. Now if that's done, start chucking some... Oh. <laughs> yeah, y'all like that? You souls are so stupid. Oh yeah. There we go. I don't know if that's going to show up as framey on the video as it was for me, but uh, that was definitely framey. Decrease mana pools, get two more perks. Nice. I'm going to go with that. So, additional damage and fire rate. Does that forget the perks that I had? Because these were the two that I had. Oh no, that's level two. So, golden weapon. And earn a new staff. If I already have one, the new one deal additional damage. Recover some mana at the start of the fight. I have the mana um, amulet, but it's not letting me use it right now. So I don't know why. This may actually be better for me than this one. 
I think I'll go with this one for for now, because oh goody, same staff I have already had. <laughs> okay, so that goes that way. Defeat all the enemies. What do we have? Gabos. Ouch. This is why I like this weapon. Okay, the alt fire is not so useful. Alright, two down. Kill your ass. Yeah, as far as that goes, I definitely preferred the um, alt fire of the Frostbow. It was definitely better. Uh, have nothing to regain from those. My alchemy is pretty low. Still can't use my mana amulet. Uh, decrease my mana pools and get two more perks. Interesting. I think I'm going to do it. Don't want a new amulet. Uh, I'll take a larger staff pool. And faster wand mana regeneration. Nice. So, how fast is it? Nice and fast. Oh yeah, look at that go. So, my mana pools are now down, like this one was 90, it's now down to 81, it looks like it drops 10%. So, I'm going to have to switch weapons more frequently. Did I get the boss key yet? Yes, I did. I actually have enough that I may want to go in there and fight him and then explore the rest of it. That was a uh, strategy in the original. My mana pools are full, except this one. Um, and while I could get more perks first, if you have high health stuff, if you get yourself all oh god, uh, this guy again, and I don't have the walls to hide behind like I did last time. Um, you like that? You like that? You like that? See what else we can get. Okay, we got those guys out. I've already got the difference in extra damage on this, and it regenerates quickly, so. back out because he did not like being roasted up close and personal with it. It's hurting me a lot to go in like that. Uh, there we go. Alright. Can I use my, my amulet yet? Jeez. Alright, nothing else. Okay. Get a new alchemy weapon. The new one will deal extra damage. That's nice. Uh, increased damage dealt when I'm low on health could be good. This is risky, but I think I will do it for the additional damage. Alright, Frostbow. I kind of prefer this one over the explosive grenade anyways, because the alt fire of the explosive grenade was so useless. And now to go finish exploring the level. With my extra level on myself. Okay, one of these. So I have to go from this one to that one, that one to that one, that one to that one, that one to that one, then I can get up there. But, you have to do it all. Ooh. Crap. Ooh. 
Ouch. Not worth it. Definitely not worth it for Falcon Wings. But if my mana amulet is useless, maybe that's what the one charge was. Oh, I see. I've got five charges of this amulet. So it looks like they don't just recharge over time like they used to. It looks like you have just straight up charges for the entire uh, the entire level. That's good to know. Um, not looking forward to going into the next level. 19 health, so let's try to survive. <laughs> this uh, this run may be cut a little short. What do we have here? A chest. Oh, goody. Thankfully, this new one does extra damage. Oh boy. God damn it. Alright, I need to level ASAP so that I can get my, uh, get some health back. Next wave in five. Ow. <laughs> okay. That run was cut just a little bit shorter. And because of the length of the first video, I'm not going to continue this. Uh, let's see, do, 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 coins found, six, yay! Defeat, mastery leveled up for I have Twilight, earned four coins, so I got to keep four of the six coins that I found. Uh, I could spend some of that on leveling this up. Back in the lab, I have seven coins. That's not enough to level up anything that was left. Uh, I don't think... Yeah, it's going to cost 8 for this one. And charges 3. So this one only has 3 charges. This one has 5 charges. So that's good to know. That is a major difference from the original one. Uh, I think you had to kill people to recharge them originally. So this one can end up having 6 charges. The other one can end up having 8 charges. But I'm looking forward to seeing what the passive effect is. I kind of want to see what that is, because if it recharges its own charges, that's going to make this the best one. Uh, this one, I'm interested in seeing what the passive effect is, whether it's a boost to speed, a boost to damage, or something else, or if the passive effect is that it recharges its charges. Um, I, I would be slightly disappointed if you don't get to recharge any of them that way. Let's see, what was it? The I have Twilight leveled up. So 10% damage. Eh. Looks like that's what most of them are going to get. Yeah, damage, passive, special. Soul Wand. I think this is going to be the next one that I really want to work on again. Saving up some coins and buffing it again to get with the passive effect. Because I am going to use this wand until I unlock a new one. And even then I may not use the new one. Uh, and I'm looking forward to unlocking more heroes. Looks like at this point there's only five, but I mean this game just launched on Steam yesterday, so it just started its early access. At least, I believe it just started yesterday. I think if you look on Steam, the release date was October 23rd. It's October 24th right now. So, uh, yep. Don't need any of those. See if it changed my available. Yep, it did change my available maps. Still don't have this because I haven't gotten a map piece. But alchemy, perk, and map piece. Wand and two perks for the let's see, length of one for alchemy, perk, and map piece. Length of one for a staff and an amulet. I might do this one next because it's only one level. If I can beat the one level, I get new staff, I get new amulet, and we already know that you don't carry over anything except coin. So, uh, I would like to try a new wand, and having more perks for level up, considering that there's 99 of them, you know, that, that would be really nice. I don't really like the one staff that I have, so upgrading this could be really handy, and getting a new amulet could be really handy, because now that I know they have charges, getting a different one. Yeah, I do have Divine Wrath. This one, for whatever reason, was not showing up when I was trying to pick my character. Maybe I can only use that one if I'm picking Karina because I was not picking her and uh, when I was going to launch the mission I did not see the Divine Wrath either time but it may just pick a random wand and then or it may pick the two wands and then a random assortment of weapons from other things 
we'll see. And aside from that, uh, if you enjoyed the video, hope to the next run goes better. Like, comment, subscribe if you feel like it, and uh, see you on the next run.